I see ambassadors of hope and opportunity as the little engine that could. Hi, I'm Zara Babitsky, the founder and executive director of Ambassadors of Hope and Opportunity. AHO helps youth in Marin County ages 16 to 25 who are forgotten. This is the AHO cottage and we have a hangout space where our youth can come and just relax, use the computer, read. Let's go inside. Okay. I wanted a home-like setting where it felt warm and comfortable and they could come and feel appreciated. I was 18 at the time when I came in, and now I am 39. When I first called Zara, I remembered that I actually I needed a place. I was couch surfing. As I was continuing to live, I realized I didn't have any life skills. I didn't know how to balance a checkbook. I didn't know about saving money. I had been hired by Sunny Hills back in 2001, and I was hired to design a program for those youth so they would have the skills and support they needed. But in 2003, the government cut the funding and I couldn't walk away from the youth who were doing well and trusting me. And I couldn't abandon them like the other adults had been. So let me see if I have this right. You had a handful of young people with really no support, no real place to go. You brought them here, no funding, that would have kept me up at night. I mean, how did you do it? That's why we're the little engine that could. <laughs> Sarah so really helped me kind of do things to be able to get jobs and help me with having a good resume for jobs and nurtured the music that I worked on. I think that's another unique feature of what we do. It's about bringing the community together. We have many dentists, for example, that donate their time pro bono. Tech support, it goes on and on. In a year period, we help about 225. About 125 or so of those are ongoing youth because we don't stop at a year or two years or three years. She's all the time for us, no matter what. This is called the Gratitude Spool. So I want to give one of you each, and you're gonna answer it. So let's start with you. Have you ever waited for something and later discovered that the way was for your good? I'm very grateful that Zara, you know, stuck in for me and went to bat for me so many times. Is being thankful a choice? If I realize that everything is a gift that's being given to me, then I can be thankful. And how do I show gratitude? I give back. In every step, it's been a healing for me as well. Since I came from a family like many of the youth and I've been homeless, uh, I am the luckiest woman in the world. <laughs> I am so grateful.